guidance and he order women Muslim women to give their boobs so a man he can meet with them and don't tell me this is for young children to do breastfeeding this is for adult you're a prophet is the only prophet you call him prophet yet he order women to give their boobs so they can be suckled this is fornication and this is nothing but pornography and I challenge you to practice what Allah Prophet said you order your wife to give her boobs to stranger I challenge you to let your wife when she go in the bus to give her boobs to everybody in the bus because it's haram for your wife to be in the bus with a group of men look what your Prophet said a woman her name is Sahil ibn to Suhail she came to the Prophet and she said my husband he don't like seeing the man who is in my house the prophet he said suckle him an advice of a prophet of God a decent prophet the woman she said how I can suckle him and he is a growing man suckling a growing man how I can suckle him and he is a growing man and already already by the way this guy he did jihad at that time we are talking about suckling him he go to war with Muhammad this guy so how she can suckle him and later we find that Muhammad wife Aisha she ordered her sisters to do suckle any man he want to enter upon her and you are talking about pornography the prophet wife she asked her sisters and her nieces To suckle any man when I enter upon them and you talk about a decent religion what pornography you know uh, uh, the Bible speak about David and David he himself he condemned himself and asked God for forgiveness and he cried for God forgiveness but you're a prophet he took the wife of his son and he's proud about it and now not only that he claimed that his God told him to take her <laughs> 